2008 Toyota Tundra with the 5.7. Uh, customer complaint is the truck stalls at a stoplight, but it does turn back on and you can drive off with it when the light turns green. Also, same thing, it stop, it, it stalls at a stop sign or a stop light. So right now I got some data pulled up and I got the, uh, I got it off idle. So the numbers are gonna be different when I put it on idle if it idles. Okay, so here's the net data. RPMs, 700, mass airflow, 6.5, okay. Voltage is good. Here's the current for the throttle body. Okay, so I'm gonna let, let it idle um, and see what happens. And I gotta feather it to idle, so otherwise it'll stall. There, it's stalled there. Okay. Uh, let I'm gonna start it back up again. Okay, it's at idle right there. First of all, I wanna see that, I see that the RPMs are too low, way low. The mass airflow at an idle, no accessories on, should be about 5.7 with the whatever the engine size is, this, which is the 5.7. This is a, and they're stalled again. And it's reading that, you know, what is it? Two something or three. Okay, start it back up. Now it's an idle again. Two seven. So right there, it gives me a flag. Something's wrong with the mass airflow or something wrong with the, how the truck is breathing air in, right? So that could be a clogged air filter, a bad mass airflow, or you know, or something like a throttle body dirty, which that's what I'm thinking. Because I'm thinking it's a thr dirty throttle body. I don't think it's a fuel. I don't think it's a clogged filter. I think it's a throttle body issue, like clogged or bad throttle body. I think that because the customer complains only at idle or when it comes to a stop or a stop light, it stalls. If he's driving the straight, cruising all along, it's fine. So that kind of eliminates, to me in my head, eliminates, eliminates that it has some kind of exhaust pressure, uh, like a catalytic converter. Um, bad not letting the exhaust exit and they can also that could also um give you a low air, mass airflow readings but it will also give you a complaint of a no power which this doesn't have so right now i'm looking at a uh, dirty throttle body or mass airflow or air filter clogged air filter so my next step is to um Inspect throttle body, mass airflow, air filter, all that, and um, and see let's see if I find anything wrong. So that's what I'm gonna do next. Do next. Also, this car, this truck had a code on the ABS for a low voltage or high voltage, and I can see why it would set that code because at idle. You know, it has very low idle, 300, 200. And of course, the alternator is not gonna charge the car, the truck. As you can see here right now, it's at, uh, let me put it here. Oh, see, there's the gauge. Okay, it started. Okay, now it's at idle right now, but you see the voltage is all the way down. It's like low voltage. So I'm gonna rev it up and you can see that the voltage goes up and it starts charging again. That's because the 
throttle body, I suspect the throttle body is not letting air in and then that would cause a low idle and the alternator does not charge at low idles. It's got to be uh, above, you know, whatever it needs to be, 500, 700 RPMs before it starts charging. So my next step is going to be to remove the throttle or inspect the air filters and stuff like that, see what I can find. And I'll give you a shot of that when I get to it. Okay, here's a shot of the throttle body. You can see it's really dirty. I'm gonna clean it and I'm gonna redo the test to see if it uh, fixes the problem. I'm pretty sure it will. Okay, here's the numbers after uh, cleaning the throttle body. You can see the RPMs up. Also, the mass airflow sensor grams per second is very close to what the engine liters are, which is again 5.7. We're at 5.8. That's perfect. That's also no problem with that. Voltage is up, of course, because the RPMs are up. So, voltage would be up. So that's good. The Throttle motor current is a steady. If I was jumping around, uh, it's a steady 1, 1 1.2 amps. Or fairly close, I guess. <laughs> so I'll call this a fix. So all I did to do is. What do you think? What do you want for lunch?